up guys welcome or welcome back to my channel my name is Laura Maurice and today I'm filming episode 13 of my southern friends chronicles so I'm opening up the vlog very differently than normal usually I'm in PJs or I don't have any makeup on but today I'm like fully dressed it's 9 30 a.m. I think we're about to leave for San Sebastián, Donostia. I don't know what it's called in English, honestly. So I just call it both. First, we are going to the bakery here in the village to grab some croissants as breakfast for today. We are just gonna eat it in the car. I'm super excited. The weather is super nice, honestly. It was supposed to be super cloudy, but pretty clear sky. I don't know if you can see, but no, you can't see very beautiful i always love like the contrast between the green trees and like the blue sky okay i'm gonna grab my bag now i think everybody's ready and then we'll be leaving for a one and a half hour mini road trip no it's not a road trip just a one and a half hour drive lighting isn't too good but i wanted to show off my outfit since i really like my outfit and i also really like papa's outfit by the way i'm wearing a stoopy set from zara i also wore it when mom and i went to maastricht for a little staycation so you maybe have seen it already in that video but i just really like this two-piece set and just have this little bag also from zara and super cute okay i don't like to show off my <laughs> feet but i'm wearing these super 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 cute sandals i already have them for quite some time like a few years already and i also had them in black i worn those black ones out i think they're sort yeah all those like little fringes on top of my foot are like falling off but i also had these ones but something broke something on the strap and i fixed it after a lot of years <laughs> and i'm super happy that i did that because now i see them on my super tan legs and i love it and it fits the outfit very very well and what are you wearing <laughs> so cute <laughs> And this is Mama's outfit. Also so cute. A little white dress. A little white dress? No, not little. Can you turn this way? A huge white dress. A <laughs> huge white dress. Oh, wow, you're the heel brown. So cute. Okay, let's go. We have arrived. It took us a little less than two hours, I think. Usually we go to a bakery to drink some coffee and eat a pastry, but we are arriving at the place and unfortunately, they're closed. This is always our first spot where we go. But it's closed, so sad. This dress was so, so beautiful, but I don't think I'm gonna wear it. Not on a regular base, so yeah. Yeah, it's 70 euros, so a little too expensive, honestly, to just wear once in a while. We're at this store, Molaya, never heard about it. Just had these two pieces on. Those two are gonna come home with me. Of course, we had to go to Zara. I didn't find that much. Only three pieces of clothing and a pair of shoes. I'm currently wearing this top. I was looking for something like this to wear under like a sweater or something. This really cute detail peeking out of a sweater. And this skirt. Don't look at the shoes. Not match match at all. But it has these very beautiful details of buttons. And I really like the, the length of it. I think it's also very nice to pair it with like some boots, like ankle boots or slippers. I think it's very versatile. And I always love an animal print. I also have this denim... I don't know the word for this. I saw a girl walking in Contis wearing this and I was obsessed with how she was wearing it. So I wanted to give it a try. Not sure if it's like me but i want to give it a try okay i'm wearing this denim piece and i like it a lot not with the shoes again but yeah i really like it i love this denim color it's not showing off on camera that well okay this is a bit better but i really like it unfortunately it has silver buttons i prefer gold honestly but yeah i think the size is also really good i'm not sure what mama is gonna think about it i'm gonna ask her now 
It's a bit of a mess in my fitting room, but these are the shoes. They're very cute. And again, animal print, just like the skirt. And about this suit. Suit is a good word for it, I think. She thinks that I'm not gonna wear it. So I think I'm gonna listen to her advice and leave it here. It's also, let me see, 40 euros. So it's not that expensive, but maybe a little too much for wearing it only every once in a while. These are the street name sign. I think it's so, so beautiful and so, I don't know, so sophisticated or something. Really pretty. We're currently at the Zara home and this is the staircase. It's so beautiful, so fancy. Marble, everything, these details. Really pretty. So we also went to another Sephora and this is a place where I did buy something. So, very happy. <laughs> This city is so beautiful. It's a big city and even has like a beautiful beach with a sort of bay. We've been walking around for quite some hours. It's now 5.30 p.m. So it's been a long afternoon and we're finally sitting down. Papa has been patiently waiting for us every time we went into a store. I feel very sorry. But now we're having a drink. I just have sparkling water. Mama has a Americano and Papa has a red wine. Prost! Um. Ooh, Mama has ordered a cheesecake and it looks very, very nice. So we're here at the Tapas Bar and we always go here when we're in Donostia. And we have our first plate. I have a sangria, Mama has sparkling water and Papa has a typical cider. I'm not sure but it looks amazing and it smells amazing. Mm. Mm, it was so yummy. It has been three years. Yeah, three years since we went to the tapas bar for the last time, and it was so so lovely and amazing sangria. And now we're walking through this very cute street. I hope you can hear me because it's pretty loud over here. But yeah, we're walking in this cute street to our car because we want to go home. Well, Mama wants to go home. Mama wants to go home. She doesn't like to drive in the dark because all the roads from the highway to Pontis are pretty dark. There's no street lights or anything. So she doesn't like to drive there when it's dark. So that's why we're leaving now. So we'll be home when it's like, not not dark, but like you know what I mean, right? It's pretty far away, but there's a church over there. How pretty to walk to walk towards that. I don't know why or how, but always when we arrive in this parking lot, parking lot, no parking garage. I don't know the word, but like a underground parking thing. It's always so freaking hot and smell like gasoline. And it's always only when we're here, never when I'm in the Netherlands. Honestly, I think, yeah. We're back in the car. Sleeping. <laughs> Good story. I just freshened up and changed to a different outfit. Long trousers and a long sleep top. Because I'm gonna have some drinks with some friends in the village. I don't think that I'm gonna film anything because awkward. I'm gonna go now. Change your plans. Dreams got cancelled. But honestly, I'm not mad about it at all because I'm pretty tired and I wanna read. <laughs> I'm a grandmother. I'm a grandmother. But yeah, I'm not mad about it at all. I just want to read. I haven't read a page today, so I feel like 
a little anxious about a day going by not reading since i have been reading literally every day since i'm here so i'm a little addicted maybe and no yeah i just want to pick up a pick up just want to pick up my book i think i'm gonna take off my makeup first and put on a mask i bought two masks today i don't know if you can see my skin is super dry over here and also on my eyes when we were in the car driving to Rostia, of course there's AC in the car and dry air and not good at all so at some point when I did this like this wrinkle over here was like sort of stuck so yeah it's terrible so I bought two sheet masks the hydrating and anti-pollution mask spirulina face mask so yeah I'm gonna put that on after I take off my makeup so I'm gonna take off my makeup right now time to go to bed i just finished reminders of him i'm so sad that it's over i don't have any more books left so this is it for this vacation huh. maybe i'm already gonna order <laughs> new books so that i'll have books when i get home because i'm off for three days monday tuesday wednesday and from thursday to sunday i'll be in switzerland with mama we're going by train that's gonna take us eight and a half hours we need to spend some time just sitting i think a book would be nice to bring i'm talking way too much i'm very tired i'm gonna give a little book review tomorrow so i'm gonna close off today's video i want to thank you guys so much for watching if you enjoyed watching today's video then please don't forget to give this one a big thumbs up and subscribe if you aren't yet and you'll see me tomorrow on episode I need to count again. Episode 14 of my Southern Friends Chronicles. Bye guys.